Once weekly, Ozempic is helping many people with type 2 diabetes like James lower their blood sugar. A majority of adults who took Ozempic reached an A1C under 7 and maintained it. Here's your A1C. Oh, my A1C is under 7. And you may lose weight. Adults who took Ozempic lost on average up to 12 pounds. I lost almost 12 pounds. Oh. Ozempic does not increase the risk of major cardiovascular events like heart attack, stroke, or death. There's no increased risk. Oh. And I only have to take it once a week. Oh. Ozempic should not be the first medicine for treating diabetes or for people with type 1 diabetes or diabetic ketoacidosis. Do not share needles or pens. Don't reuse needles. Do not take Ozempic if you have a personal or family history of medullary thyroid cancer, multiple endocrine neoplasia syndrome type 2, or if you are allergic to Ozempic. Stop taking Ozempic and get medical help right away if you get a lump or swelling in your neck, severe stomach pain, itching, rash, or trouble breathing. Serious side effects may include pancreatitis. Tell your doctor if you have diabetic retinopathy or vision changes. Take Taking Ozempic with a sulfonylurea or insulin may increase low blood sugar risk. Common side effects are nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, stomach pain, and constipation. Some side effects can lead to dehydration, which may worsen kidney problems. Once weekly Ozempic is helping me reach my blood sugar goal. You may pay as little as $25 per prescription. Ask your healthcare provider today about once weekly Ozempic.